Change your love today. Please, uh, Jello, please only. I had two fruits of tomato into the paste that I chopped. And then this is going to give the color. You better give the color because I don't have any other. And I added my ruby stem radish. This radish is pepperish, like spicy. So it's going to give it more spice. I added a burning pepper. So I so had the whole of this. Everything inside. I've used maybe half of it already. So there's only like one and a half left. Or let me see. So yeah, I've used a bit of this, and somehow I also used a bit of this. So that's weird. But anyway, I'm putting both of them, and I'm pretty sure I'm going to be adding both or one and a half of this too. So, anyways, we'll see how that goes. So I added everything from added chili pepper, two kinds of chili pepper actually, and that's cilantro, allspice, and ground cloves. And then I have cumin too. Um, I ran out of cumin. I only have like a little bit left, which I'm going to use to spice up my chicken. Because what is jollof rice without a decent amount of protein? What is jello fries without a decent amount of protein? Hmm? Tell me, what is jello fries? So that's what's happening. Today is Sunday, by the way. Sunday. Like, I'm tired. I just went down to No Flows to buy this. And, and just the chicken. I have the... I'm planting. I have the fish already in my freezer. So, that's what's up. I think this is my first, no, this is not my first time cooking jello fries, but it is my first time cooking jello fries outside of my regular home, like my family home. So, yeah, yeah, it's my first time outside my home. Like, I've cooked, I've cooked a lot of jello fries plenty of time in my own household, like my family household, but it's actually the first time that I will do it outside. So, this thing better taste tasty because I have not suffered for it not to taste. <laughs> I have not suffered for it not to taste good. Not to taste tasty. Yeah, I have not suffered for it not to taste tasty. Sometimes I don't like to use um, ground. Yeah, sometimes I don't like to use allspice and ground cloves because it turns the your food dark like look at mm, i have to clean it's gonna be a lot of cleaning afterward but anyways yeah but it's jello fries so it's gonna balance out i'm pretty sure but right now i'm going to add one more of this yeah i'm gonna add one more and i'm pretty sure i'm going to end up using the whole pack but let's just do it Step by step, the plight of making jollof rice. This is going to be a serious cleaning after. Chicken time. Mm. Chicken time. Chicken is done, but I'm going to grill it too. It looks pretty much done, but I'm sure it can. Uh, it needs a little bit more heat. So our another protein, our other protein is fishes, mackerel. A protein we have is actually this, but yeah, it's not. I mean, it's it's not ripe yet, but it's ripe enough that it can be fried. If you get what I mean. Gonna wrap this. Um, there's no. This is how I'm doing it. This is how I'm going to wrap it. That's all. And once the other one is ready, it's going to go in. It's going to go inside the oven too. Inshallah. Where's that fish? I'm going to eat this one because I'm hungry. Oh. I added some oil. 
I don't know if you can see, but I added a little bit of palm oil. So yeah, I just added some olive oil, I think, or is it canola? I don't know. I added some oil and I'm gonna wait for some minutes to for it to fry. Yeah, you want to fry jello pepper. You don't wanna yeah, you wanna fry jello pepper and not cook it. So you're gonna know, let it well you wanna cook it and you want but the main thing is you want to fry it okay so our jollof stew or jollof base is ready now i'm going to add this oh my god so both of this contain chicken stock uh, that i have been saving to use for any time i make jollof of course so that's the first one and this is the second one you know in that holding this of holding this when i when you go to parties there is not all this um so when you go to parties in those olden days i mean they make chicken they cook um, some beef and when the stock is what they use to make jello fries today they will add people will add like corn veggies and all those kind of stuff to their um, jello fries but the real jello fries the real jello fries is just with like some cubed diced um, liver and onions sliced onions and sliced tomatoes that they will add at the very very end maybe they will add the liver in the middle of the cooking like the meat section of the cooking but the but they will slice onions and tomatoes at the very very end so it doesn't become soggy give it a bit more crunchiness or flavor or whatever but of course Today you have you can add different kind of veggies. So these are uh, rice. It's inside our everything. Sha, it's inside. I'm going to stir it. Another reason why you you fry this and um, jollof base or stew or whatever is because you don't want it to be soggy. If if I don't fry it. Like if I don't evaporate all the water from the pepper away, the jello fries might turn soggy. I mean, like there's nothing wrong with soggy jello fries. Some people cook it and it's quite delicious. But for what I'm going for today, it's not what I'm going for. It's not what I'm going for. So this will have to do. You just have to wait some. Oh, I think it's about four thirty now. Yeah, four thirty two. So, let's give this some minutes to cook. So, our onion has been sliced. Maybe I should add more onion to it, but I'm not going to do that. This is all I'm using. And the rice is cooking. This is definitely done. Yeah, it's not going to be too hot or something, so... This is done, and this is done as well. And I'm gonna turn this off. I'm pretty sure they uh, pull back the time, so it's actually 4:46, not five. Notes. It's time for my grip, so I'm gonna go grab my grip. You know, I'm eyeing, I'm eyeing this plantain. Especially, I could I could do this one, but it's still it's still kind of hard. Yeah, it's still hard. So maybe I should leave it till tomorrow. But then I was thinking, just add it to my jello fries, my protein, and you know? like. The more the merrier on the plate, like. Anyway, sure. 
Anyways, I gotta go pray. Anyways, Aisha is gonna go pray. Yes, Aisha is gonna go pray. And see you when I'm eating, or I don't know when I'll see you again, but I'll just see you. Okay, it looks like it's done, but it's not done. If you look closely, you can see there are still some that looks a little hard or whitey. So I'm going to add, I'm going to put vodka so it can steam more. What you need is just steaming and to cook it really so. So it's all ready to go. I'll just cover this up. That wasn't what I was going for, but <laughs> okay, that looks about right. So, I'm just gonna wait for Jollof to cook truly because me, I'm hungry since I don't even know what time I started. Okay, so I went to shop, yeah, I went to shop for all these ingredients around. Around one o'clock. I came back like around two o'clock. Yeah, I came back like around two o'clock. So it's five twelve right now. So no, it's five ten actually. This one is a little faster. So it's five ten right now. So yeah, so it's five ten, and that means I've been doing this since two o'clock. 2 30 ish, 3 hours now. Which is not bad, really. It's actually not bad. For jello fries, it's not bad. Because I, I, I mean, like, I did chicken, fish, this jello, with like blending hours. It's actually not bad, like under 3 hours. That is not bad. Look at this red, red jello fries. Yeah, I didn't know. Oh. If some part of it is already, that's why I turn this thing down so it doesn't. But that's okay. You know, some people will say the burnt part of the jollof rice is the best part. Some people knew. Some people will say that. You know, let me reduce this a little bit. I'll still leave it on for a while because I still feel like. It still needs a little bit of steaming. But taste-wise, it's good. I was really scared actually that it's going to be too salty or too much with the stock that I added. But it's not bad. Now, before I cover it again, for the last kind of bit of steaming, it's going to need to. I'm going to. I'm going to add this. You know, you can dice onion too. You can dice the onion in there. But me, I don't have time. Like, the way that I remember that jello fries is made, like, there's no side. The only side you're going to get is whether chicken or beef. Eh, fried chicken or beef. Yeah. Once everything is done like this, then I add the onions and slice some um, tomato. But me, I don't have fruit tomatoes. So, this is what's going to be. This is what's gonna do. This is what's gonna work. Let's take some part of this. I'll take some. I'll take some onions. But you can always dice onions. Yes, that kind of person that likes onions. You can always dice onions. Yeah, if you are that kind of person that like onions, 
Then dice on hands to you. It tastes very good. But I need it to cook a little bit more. It is. It's not bad. Like, don't get me wrong, it's not bad. It tastes really good. But I want it to be a little softer, the rice itself. A little. Honestly, you can really dice onions to jollof rice. The, it's the, crunch, the crunchiness. It's so good. This girl, she doesn't let me hear any word, anything. Ah, oh no, you just want to know that one more trick to my hair. I'm not going to delete this out. I'm oh going god, to... ten thousand on your head. I'm watching my water. Oh god, the ending was hey. So this series finale. It's the finale. You don't know how to wait for it till next series. year. Oh. This season is done till oh, next okay. year. Maybe ten thousand on your head. <laughs> Maybe I one day I'll watch, watch this other show because ah, if, oh, if oh, you guys I don't hear my bald head right now. <laughs> if you guys hear the kind of uh, noise that I've been enjoying, making that much noise, I was like, it was ha it was ha ha. It was intriguing. It's my love. It was intriguing. Oh my god, they don't even let me kit up and do makeup. Oh yeah. Me, I need I, me is the one that need no makeup. We don't need makeup. That's what I mean. I think you need makeup. I'm going to moisturize my hair. Well, anyway, look at her. I, I just wanted to um, cover it now to steam. To yeah. steam That's <laughs> what I need. You want. Ah! Oh my god! Hey, that's the one. It is here. No, it's um I found it from my site, so I think it's so it's to be and point the way now then throw it to the So this abatio, I don't know what I don't know more. Hey, you got the next year. This is the sign for us for us all to go and watch abatio. I don't know. I don't know what this abatio is about, but my girl has been disturbing me. Okay, I didn't know this is the this jollof rice is gonna turn out just like red. Um I guess my show is not bad. It's not bad, it's not bad. It's actually Antio come Yeah. Just come. Come now. No, Kosi. You know, I'm just feeling that some part of it is like this part. Look. Koro. Yeah. Eh, cover it now. Oh, my shade. You need to shape up. They happen like that. I don't know if she found a passage of love. I mean, no. Oh, my, you are. <laughs> so why why become me? Yeah, that's what I want to show you. Like it, like Just cover it. You steam into everything, my own shape up. And even if the majority, oh, I'm not even recording. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Me, I'm hungry, so I'm going to just eat. If this thing like you should, because I don't know why one part will like most of this is cooked, but there are some like this tiny tiny ones inside that's just giving me the eye. But anyway, but this is all done. Like hmm, this is done, and I know this good. I'm not even joking, Auntie. You could come and eat so if you want. Um,
But this is good. Mm. Mm. My food is good, like I shall do. Mm? I shall do. Oh, I always say Aisha's food and say they don't see food. You can come and eat if you want. Don't say Aisha is stingy because I'm not stingy. So come and eat. But anyway, it's a very good one. See me, see me, see my dodo, and see Papa, see Bobby, see Papa. Ah ah, golden bob, my clothes are like gong gong. Your tongue will not taste this. Your tongue, even your nose self, will not smell this. But anyway, Aisha, you can feed your eyes, cause you know Aisha is selfless like that. I will share share this with you, okay? You can take as many as you want. You can even take the whole thing. Kimchi with fried rice. It is good. I mean, this kimchi is a little bit tangy and sour, but it's still good. The last time I tasted kimchi, which was why I actually went to get this one. That one tasted so good. But anyways, it's still good. I will definitely recommend it. Let me show you the full plates. What the full plates actually look like. Dun, dun, dun. 